out some bloom paints that are drying up earlier since I haven't used them in maybe a year. Um, and I decided that I have this swatch sheet here which has all my pigments on it. I have the same thing for all the paints. But they're really small and there's a couple colors that I thought were pretty similar in TLPs and in the um, eye candy pigments. And so I decided to swatch them on a bigger piece of paper um, just to see if they really work the same. And so I thought you might find this interesting in case you're shopping for them. Um, like a TLP is, is this size. And then there's a smaller size of the eye candy. It's still more than that. And then there's the larger 50 grams of um, eye candies. And they're all cheaper or the same price as this tiny little container. So if these are the same price, um, these are the same color as this one, and you're, you really want to try them, but you're on a budget, I thought this could help somebody else as well. Um, so the first one was Constellation and Purple Garden and Eye Candy. They're very similar to me. And then Harvest Gold and Imperial Gold, those don't really match now that I've swatched them on here. Uh, Sapphire TLP and No Con Blue for eye candy, which I like to add to my impression blue. And those are very similar, if not the same, in my eyes. Um, the same goes for Emerald and Dark Ocean Green. I think those are very similar, if not the same. I don't really use this color very much, but since I had it. And then we had Lily Pad, and in eye candy it would be green tea. And this one has a little more bubbles in it, but those are very, very similar. And then the Magical Ore that everybody likes to use. So it is very similar to Zirin Gold, but it's not exactly the same. But if you wanted to try it, it would probably be close enough. Um, the Imperial Gold is a little bit more yellow, so it didn't quite match there. And then for t the Taffy in TLP, which is a color I really like, it's like a super shiny blue. Um, we have this Azora. I don't know, I think I spelled it wrong, but we have this Azora blue and this Zephyr blue, which... Um, it looks to me like the Azora is pretty much closer than that one, but they're, they're very similar. So we could get a whole container of this size of taffy. And then for sea glass, I found chartreuse was similar, but once I put them on the page together, um, the chartreuse is a little bit less mirror-like than the sea glass, but if you're looking for a substitute, that's pretty close. And then... Mermaid, which is very popular as well. Um, to me, Okinawa Blue in eye candy is pretty much the same, and the Sora Arrow was a little bit deeper, so I can't really tell the difference between Okinawa Blue and Mermaid. So if you wanted to upsize your, your Mermaid, there there's that. And um, the rest of these didn't end up matching as well as I thought they would, so like Lagoon doesn't really match what I thought it would, but... Color Arts Guatemalan Green is very similar to this one that I can't pronounce, um, but they didn't actually end up matching in the end. And then this is just a really cool color shift that I have. I don't have a match for that, but I don't know. I thought you might find this interesting in case... I, I know Mermaid's been a very popular one for people, and if you wanted to save some money... And you have to buy a lot of TLPs to get free shipping. You don't really have to buy that much of this to get um, a few colors for... And they always have a discount, and I have a discount for 10% off, but during the holidays they have even better discounts than that. So if you're interested, um, you can always get a, a little bit more of a discount on them.